Hi, my name is Matt Foose. I'm an advisor with Lime Painting of Boulder. And uh, we had the pleasure of just uh, finishing a restoration on a magnificent home in Legend Ridge Trail. It's in Niwot, Colorado, just a few miles outside of Boulder. One of the first things that we did on this home was a gutter replacement. Uh, when I first walked on the property, I could see that several miters and areas of um, the gutters were failing, leaking onto the fascia and soffits, causing distressed wood. So, you know, it's very counterproductive for us to paint the exterior of a home if the gutters are not doing their jobs properly. So what we did is we uh, replaced all of the gutters on the second floor, six inch gutters and three by four downspouts on the upper level, uh, replacing their five inch and two by three system, which is a little outdated for the size of this home. So one of the signs of gutter failure on this home was just the distressed waterlogged wood. It was easy to see from the eye. Soffit boards were waterlogged, fascias were heavily distressed, peeling. Um, so when the gutters were removed, we were able to do replacement. We replaced several fascia and soffit boards throughout the property. It's one of the things that sets Lime apart is just being able to deal with all these substrates from gutters to board replacement and carpentry to painting. So after the gutters and the carpentry was done, we move into the prep phase of the project. And this is where, in my opinion, we set ourselves apart from other painting companies. We know that jobs are won and lost through quality prep. So, um, you know, very, very meticulous prepping. We, we cover light sconces, you know, we cover the different colors of stucco, the accent trim, windows. We really want to make sure that just everything is prepped properly for the coating. The last portion of the prep for this project was stucco prep. This home had several cracks, some chunks of stucco that were actually, you know, missing from hail damage. Uh, so, you know, we used the stucco composite material to skim sections. We did Loxon XP on the stucco here. Um, analytical gray on the body and um, a lighter gray for the trim. Trim items up top, the wood items, uh, we did an, like an iron ore, a darker gray for the gutters fascia. And we matched the uh, Loxon XP with duration satin um, on the soffit boards. There was quite a bit of damage to the stucco on the volleyball court. We elected to just go ahead and caulk all the major cracks. We did some minor patching and skimming, which is included in pretty much all of our projects. So what we did is we used um, 950A caulk from Sherwin-Williams, which um, is a very nice caulk for cracks because it doesn't flash as much as some of the elastomerics. So when the sun hits it, you know, they're not flashing. You don't see them quite as much. So here in the back of the home, which is definitely my favorite part of this house, you get into some of the features. Uh, another thing that we did for them is we painted all of their fencing, their balcony railings, uh, with a uh, special paint formulated specifically for metal called DTM, and really, really revived this. The, the railings were rusting and oxidized quite heavily, uh, so we put a black, tricorn black DTM on these railings, and they really turned out fantastic. We restored some of the concrete slabs. Um, some of the upper level balconies, as well as some stuff around back, had chunks of concrete that had fallen off, and we had our mason come out and fix those. But we also pulled off the light caps here on the steps and painted those as well. Those, those little touches sometimes are uh, kind of the cool thing that, that sometimes people miss. They had really nice golden oak beadboard ceilings, which matched their previous color well. But once we changed the color to a darker color, they just stood out a little bit. So what we did is we put a stain blocking primer on the entirety of the golden beadboard uh, ceilings, both in the front and in the back, and then coated that with the same duration color that we did for their soffits. And uh, Legend Ridge, again, like I said, is one of my favorite neighborhoods to work at. The homes are all uh, just gorgeous. It really makes my job fun uh, to work on properties like this and to be able to do masonry, gutters, painting, DTM, all of those things really um, sets Lime apart, I think, in terms of being able to deal with different coatings and different substrates, all with the same crew. And as always, get limed.